Good morning, my Leo Virgo cusps. This is Lana the Canadian Medium. I'm bringing you your February forecast and what things are going to be going on for you in the month of February. Please hit like and subscribe for a chance to win a free reading or hypnosis. I just did my January one. This is January where I'm doing these. Um, also visit EnchantedSky.com to book a reading. Um, visit my blog. My Facebook, my Twitter, my Instagram. Um, you can also buy, uh, visit my events page. I'm in the process of opening up my own store um, where I'm teaching not just art classes, but um, spiritual wellness classes, I guess you could say, uh, tarot cards and um, psychometry classes. That's the art of reading objects. Um, intention bracelets, all kinds of stuff. I also teach art classes. So... Uh, with that said, let's see what we can get done here today. Okay, these are your overall cards of the reading. I started doing this. It's helping some to make it a little clearer for you. Now... Your first two cards. In the past, there's been some, you know, you've been holding tight to your money. And there's been some emotional stuff that goes with this. Now, this is a, can a card of cancer. Um, I want, and it's also a confusion card. Things are a little hidden. Um, you've been holding on to your money, being kind of careful with what you're doing. Okay, and probably and most likely in the month of, of January. You know, January is our month where we're trying to catch up from Christmas. With me, I'm trying to catch up with my kid. All my kid, everybody I know has their birthday in January. So I'm not only broke from Christmas, I'm broke from birthdays. I'm broke from. Uh, anyway, but you, I know that you've been holding on to your money, watching your finances, being careful what you're doing. And you've been a little afraid. You're, you know, you're having a judgment. So you may owe some money to somebody. All right? Um, there may be, maybe you have a, a ticket you had to go to court for, okay? That could be due. Um, some things do, but it's also going to be fair to you. Now, you, this card has affected this card. This card is a five of pentacles. It's affecting... Um, I mean the four, four of Pentacles, excuse me. This is affecting the Five of Pentacles. You've been a little afraid of not being able to pay your bills or make things meet or something of that nature. Now, when I see a Five of Pentacles, I always think that this is, you're down and out. You could be injured, you could be, but it's usually with this card, it's a fear of that. Okay, it's more of a fear. So that's why you're holding on to your money so tight. You may have some things that are due. Okay, you may have some, maybe you needed a set of tires, you know you needed one, it snowed, you know, if you're up north, it's something like that, okay? So, but you're getting your justice, so everything's going to be, everything's going to work out great for you, okay? So, in the middle of the month, when we start our Mercury in retrograde, which we're in a Mercury in retrograde, by the way, and I will explain what that is, because I don't care what anybody says, they're true, you know, you're going to have justice. So it's going to be okay. You're going to be all right. And I want to say you're doing a little soul searching, but you're going to get your wish. I want to say for some people, they're getting just enough money to come in to pay their bills so that they have justice. Because it did, like I said, there's lots of cards here that are, um, there's lots of money cards here. You know, um, a lot of you guys are getting your, your I think, you're getting your taxes done. I think that's what for this for people in the United States. I feel like that's what this is. You're going to get the amount of money that you need to get, okay? And that's why there's some soul searching because you're like, okay, I got to find somebody good. I feel like even you might be switching like a tax person going to going to somebody new or somebody who can help you. I feel like you're getting some help, okay? Um, you're not doing them yourself. And I, my advice to you is go get some help because some of these people know things 
and they know they understand taxes where you get tax breaks that you don't even know you had and you and they're totally there's nothing wrong with them they're totally legal and they help you get more money back and I do feel like you're gonna get your wish so and this is the wish card you're content and you're getting your wish so you know you've been a little bit watching your money been a little bit scared about paying some bills or something but it, look, it's all going to work out this month. All right for you. All right. Now, you might be going with speed and haste because this is your overall card. Your overall card is you're going quickly towards your goal. So maybe perhaps you're trying to save up for something. All right. You're trying to save up for something in this month. Deciding that, you know, I'm going to save up for start saving for my vacation. Okay. I'm going to do this. I'm going to, you know, and you're going to have enough car money to and you're gonna get your wish so if you're putting a number in your head and waiting for you know some money to come back that's that's what's going to happen now for some of you guys I know there's some type of you know like I want to say like some of these people are getting maybe a, a bill and they were it's much more than they, it's not as much as they thought it would be they're be like, oh yay <laughs> that wasn't as bad as I thought it would be Okay, because you are you are getting justice. So, you know, and this whole time, and I can see what you're doing is you're doing a little soul searching. You're doing a little soul searching, going, okay. Now, there's got to be a little bit easier way, guys, to yeah have some strength, have some strength, and see it through. Um, and you're going, you know, I gotta search this out and figure this out for myself. How can I? make more money how can i get out of the situation and make myself happy you know um so that i'm a little bit less stressed out about stuff okay um like i said i feel like some people i have to go to court all right um and that they're getting their wish you know maybe maybe you are in court maybe you um have to go to court and you've been down and out because you're trying to get custody, okay? It could be something like that, okay? Um, you Maybe you're going to traffic court, and you thought you were going to get this huge fine, and it wasn't. Maybe you're waiting for a estimate on your car because you banged it up. It's something of that nature, okay? I have every, every, every month, they'll be like, well, I didn't, that I resonated with me except for that. I'm just giving possible examples, okay? But you know your life and you know what's going on. I'm just like offering it things, okay? It doesn't necessarily mean that's what's happening. But you are going to get your wish this month in a positive direction. With quickly too, with speed and haste. I always say you're speed and haste, you're going towards your goals. So it's gonna whatever's gonna happen is gonna happen fairly quickly this month, okay? Now, you got a Queen of Cups here. And the Queen of Cups is a water sign. You are not a water sign. And I want to say that this person, you're going speed and haste. This may, be a, this may be a relationship. Maybe you have met somebody and it starts to go quickly. Okay? Um, I feel like for some of you, this is a friend. Okay? And... They're helping somehow. They're, I don't know. They're, I'm, they're the reason or the cause that you're doing the soul searching. Okay. Um, I feel like too, for some people, they may be looking for a new apartment or looking to move and they found what they wanted and everything, like they can put their deposit down and somebody made them a deal. You know, so it was a little cheaper because, you know, this is, there's a little bit of money involved in this. The money, the money cards, see the money cards are involved. You're holding tight onto your money, waiting for a judgment, waiting for, you know, what do I, you know, what, where's my money going? And it's going to be exactly what you want. So whatever you want this month is going to happen for you. Okay. So now. Let me tell you a little bit about this Mercury in retrograde thing. The Mercury in retrograde goes the middle of February into the first week of March. It lasts about, oh, about five to six weeks, okay? It is a time that can be crappy <laughs> or good, 
depending on what sign it's in. Right now, this in 2020, in February, it's going to be in Pisces. Now, for some of you, it's going to be difficult. And I am a Pisces moon. I'm not sure how it's going to go. But I am a Sagittarius. I did look this up and found out that in Sagittarius, that my uh, Mercury in retrograde should go fine. I've only had one good Mercury in retrograde without something stupid happening. And that, and, and I'll tell you in a minute what I mean by stupid, is that um, when I was in Sagittarius, it was the best six weeks. I'm, you know, I think it's six or is it five? I, I, I'm not sure. I'm, I just know Mercury in retrograde starts, oh, on a cup, like into the second week, the very second weekend of February and goes all the way into March. So it's more like a month, but I thought it was a little longer than that. But um, anyway, all they know is that I pay attention because I try really hard not to do anything too much with paperwork. See, justice, if you have to do any paperwork or go to court, I pray that I don't get a review from work during Mercury and retrograde because trust me, it's not good. It's, it just, there's lots of people that you usually get in an argument. Um, something breaks, something to do with your car a lot. Um, your computers go bizarre, funky, do stupid stuff. You lose emails, can't find them. It's just weird things happen. It has something to do with electronics and the energy in the air. But um, also, you revisit things. And what it does is Mercury, uh, things appear like it's going backwards. You revisit um, old pain, old hurts, so that you can heal. So this is a time of reflection also. And I'm not saying everybody's going to have a bad Mercury in retrograde. Matter of fact, if I remember correctly, there were two or three signs, and you might look this up on the internet. I have not blogged about any of this, but I understand it. That there should be a couple of signs that's not, that are not affected at all. Like, I'm pretty sure Sagittarius is going to be... Oh, fine. And I'm being a Pisces. I am guessing that my that this should be an okay to a good one for me. But we never know. I have had so many things happen. I've lost phones where my phone just died in the middle of a Mercury and retrograde. I had to get a new phone. So just be aware of those energies as you're looking at these cards. But you are going to get your wish. So this could be a relationship. This could be, I'm, you know, I've, I'm talking about money, but, you know, maybe you're getting that shot at somebody, you know, because it does, there is, like I said, there is a Queen of Cups. That Queen of Cups is the water sign of uh, Scorpio, um, Scorpio, Cancer, and Pisces. So, or it could be a friend, but it could be somebody you going towards. It could be a, a male also with female energy, which is very creative, very passionate, very artistic. Okay, so either way, you've got a couple of different things happening. But I am encouraging you not to hide ever through a Mercury in retrograde, but I want you to be careful and make the choices. For me, I'm in the process, like for instance, I know I'm getting ready to buy a large item. Um, and I honestly am waiting until Mercury is out of retrograde. 